okay so now let's take a look at the question given in our question paper for question number 9 so we need to create a report and we need to make a query for this so the first query is what it's uh, an employee has been working there for 10 years and this is the it should be less than so less than 10 years from 2019 so we have to just select 2009 and then here uh, it says the employee born after so anybody after that particular date okay so let's make the query for this so we go to the database access <coughs> and then if you look into the design view which I have already created so this is the first condition uh, that is the employee should be working there for more than 10 years so this is the query the condition 12 to 2009 and the date of birth so again we need to do the date of birth here and after that what information do we need so we need the surname the date of birth of course an employee then the first name employer and the address and all the information we can select here and keep it ready then after that we will go to the report so I hope you already know how to create the report so we can go to the report wizard and then we can select all the fields that we need so first we need to select the query one and then we will select all the fields from here okay so we will select all the fields and whatever you need then we can continue to the next so we have to now by employer so you have to go by the employer the address and also you have to select as you can see here the employer then okay um, uh, I think the job description will be there at the top so we can go next and the job description will be at the top so first first will be the job description and and then the address so we go back so first will be the job description the address and then the other details so we can have this as a layout and when you click on next so we can arrange in ascending or descending order I think here there's nothing mentioned over there so don't worry so click on next and if it is in a landscape or portrait do it, does it say anything so if it doesn't say we may just select the portrait and click on next and we can click finish so we will get this and then of course we have to arrange it accordingly so I have already arranged if you go to the employee I have arranged according to the question paper so you may go to the design view over here and try to arrange your information accordingly you give a header and then the job header will be here and the details the employer the address the first name last name the date of birth and the date employment started so try to arrange accordingly and then when you click on view the output should be like this okay output so we don't have to do any kind of calculation over here so it is just this one 